Do you think you're ready to test your geriatric medicine knowledge? Let's find out. A 75-year-old woman comes for her annual checkup. She lives independently, exercises daily, and has well-controlled hypertension. She has a 10-year life expectancy based on her comorbidity index. Her last pap test at age 64 and all previous results were normal. She continues regular mammography and had a colonoscopy five years ago showing no abnormalities. Which of the following best reflects an appropriate preventive care plan for this patient? Most exams aren't indicated that the life expectancy is less than five years, um, but I wouldn't just depend. I, I've got a chart coming up which uh, shows you uh, when to consider stopping these uh, screening tests for cancer, but in a very vital patient, don't necessarily think that just because they uh, have reached the age of 75, therefore it's, it's absolutely the time to uh, stop screening. Um, actually, it may be uh, better to continue to screen those patients. And in a patient who's 60, um, but facing multiple severe illnesses with a, a very poor prognosis, they don't, they don't necessarily need to go through cancer screening. They have enough probably going on in terms of their medical care, just keeping up with uh, appointments for multiple, multiple specialists, multiple tests and procedures. And therefore, you know, it's, it, the safe thing is always involve patients and or their caregivers in decision making. That said, cervical cancer screening, that one is more of a hard stop just because the risk of cervical cancer among women with previous normal uh, cervical cancer screening tests is very low. So no matter what their you know, level of vitality and their life expectancy is, if they have a, a several normal um, uh, pap tests in the past, I, I generally will stop uh, cervical cancer screening at age 65. Age 75 is definitely the year to stop screening for prostate cancer. Uh, consideration to screen, stop screening for colorectal cancer. You can actually, rec you can consider stopping breast cancer screening, um, but for a lot of women, they might go through age 80 or even 85 continuing with breast cancer screening.